Hi, this is a 1988 Les Paul Custom Light Showcase Edition in gold top with black hardware and factory original EMG 81 pickups. This is a limited edition um, run that they did in 1988 of the Les Paul Custom Lights, which are much thinner than a regular Les Paul Custom. Um, and they only did about 200, of the, uh, 200 in the Showcase Edition and only 50 or so in the gold top with black hardware. Um, just comparison for a, a Les Paul Custom Light with a regular Les Paul Custom. So this is a uh, 87 Les Paul Custom, and you can see here how much thinner they are. But from the front, they look very, I mean, it looks, it's a Les Paul Custom. Another big difference is they have the comfort cut on the side, as well as being much thinner. Um, so this weighs in at about 10 pounds, and this weighs in at about 7 pounds. So being much thinner, it's a much more comfortable guitar to hold for a long time. And I would say the thin profile is very similar to like an SG as far as the thickness. But it, the neck is fat and feels just like a Les Paul, what you would expect it to feel. So we're going to go through some uh, play tones for the bridge and neck. And given that these are EMG pickups, they're active pickups, uh, I'll try to do some heavy chugging sounds. So uh, we're playing through a uh, Hot Rod Deluxe um, with all dials at noon, and I've got a little bit of reverb on the pedal board. So this is the bridge pickup. This is the first pair of EMGs that I've ever played on, and they sound pretty good to me. Um, I've always heard that they're kind of sterile and really only good for metal, uh, but those sounded decent. And uh, something that's really interesting, they're active pickups, so the grounding issue when you take your hands off, you don't hear any grounding sounds. All right, so now we're going to try some, uh, I have an OCD, just we'll do some overdrive sounds, see how the EMGs sound with that, and then um, we'll go into some heavier gain. So this is a... Some light drive in the bridge. Big Muff with Fuzz and we'll boost that with the OCD, but first I have a DoD Gunslinger, which is kind of like a uh, Marshall in a box, uh, like an overdriven Marshall. And so when I think of 80s, you know, heavy metal sounds, that's what I think of is just heavy, like driven Marshalls. So. so we're in the bridge here. If you boost these with the drive, you get some really nice kind of pinch harmonic temp tones. Yeah, so that's uh, you don't want to do that too much. That's cool, but also very annoying. 
Um, so we'll drive it with the Big Muff. I actually think the Big Muff has like a very good uh, kind of chugging sound. And we'll drop it to drop D. It's a very comfortable guitar. It's very, it's in great shape and it's very pretty. Um, it's very rare to see like a gold top in these uh, Les Paul custom lights. Um, so yeah, this is a really interesting, unique guitar. It's rare um, and it plays great. It feels just like a Les Paul custom minus all of the weight. So I hope you enjoyed the demo. Let me know if you have any questions.